Hello everyone and welcome to part one of OneNote tutorial. Uh, today you are going to learn on how to create a OneNote page which is a notebook. So my computer is open. I'm going to open my menu and then I will click OneNote 2016. Okay. So when you have opened one note this is the layout on how it looks like remember this is microsoft one note it comes from the microsoft package just like microsoft Word, excel powerpoint and others that we know but this one is specific for creating notes so when you see a page like this this is the menu and this is how the menu looks like and then now you have a portion where you are going to create your notebooks so this is because uh, one note was created as a platform to write notes using a computer rather than writing them in a book having many pages and uh, many notebooks so we have an app which is notebook coming from one note application so here where you see notebooks is where you can click to create your own notebook and that that is where you start I'm going to click there now and then you find this option that says add notebook so when I click there it has to locate where you are going to save so when you create a new notebook like we see now it has to be stored somewhere in a computer and this is what we are doing now so i'm going to say this pc and then i'm going to give it a name all right so if i name it ngangala ngangala tivet college so i have to actually browse okay this is the name of the notebook that i will have then i will have to create in a different folder right so remember that name that i've shown you or that the one that i've typed it is appearing again there because that is the name of the notebook i'm saving so i can save this notebook under documents and then i can save it in any folder that i create so i can create a new folder and then this folder here i can name it notes okay then that is where i know that my notebook is going to be saved all right so i click create okay so now you see there where it was saying notebook now it's saying kangala tv at college because that is the new notebook it's no longer just a notebook without a name so inside a notebook you must know that you are going to have pages all right so your pages will appear inside what we call sections so after creating a notebook like we did now in Kangala Tivet, as you see, we have to create sections for this notebook. So I can create a section by clicking this button here with an, a, a plus sign. When I click it says section 2. I click the other one that is section 3. So in this part 1, I just want to show you how to work in a notebook in terms of creating sections and also how to create pages so now this section we have to rename it section one i can right click on it and go to rename so then i can give it a name let me just give it middle back and then if i go to section two right click rename maybe i say weed bank and then I go to section 3, right click, rename, and then I can see CN Mashangu. Okay. I can create section 4 and name it Vatarfar Boven. Then I can create section f uh, the other one. Then it will be my fifth section, although it's in section 1 because I've renamed those sections. So it doesn't see any other section 1. So I have to rename this again to be a new name, to have a new name. So I can name this one Mpondo Zangomo. So remember, these are just names of sections. Because now this is a digital book. 
So my digital book is having a notebook called Ngangala Tivet College. Then I have a section in this notebook, which is the middle bag. When I click middle bag, when it pops up like this, it means I'm inside middle bag here where you see the cursor with the date and time to show that the notes that I'm going to type are typed at what time and when under which section. So this is a page. Okay. So if I go to weed bank, it means whatever I'll be doing under here, it will be for weed bank just like that. So it means you need to know which section you are under. Like for instance, if I click middle bag, you see middle bag is the one that is blue. And then it means now there on the right hand side, I can add pages for middle bag. And then here with bank, you see with bank color also uh, the color affects what you see on the right hand side. It means I'm under with bank. Now this is orange. If I click CN, everything becomes orange on the right pink for bova bova on the so it helps you to know that whenever you are writing in a page you are actually in track uh, on track in terms of knowing which page are you writing for so this page is for bova because it's pink then if i go to orange this page is for cn because it's orange so it helps you to keep track of which section are you under when you create pages so now you have learned how to create sections Thank you for watching. Please watch part two as I'm going to show you how to create pages for each section. Thank you for watching.